What's up guys, this is Josh, and I'm going to show you how to use groups in your apps and stuff. So, it's real easy. All you got to do is to make a group, is just, what you're going to call the group, and then equals display new group, and that makes the group. And to put things into the group, all you got to do is the name of the group, and then semicolons, and insert, and then the name of the object you're putting into the group. So, this is my BPA game, which I use a splash screen on, and... Um, well, this is the splash screen, and since they're all in the group, the, group, the code tells when I click a button to remove the group. So when I click on that, everything fades off the screen. But if I was going to go back into the code and remove some of these objects from the group and save it, and go back here and do it again the objects stay onto the screen and they don't get removed and since the code tells the group is being removed and not the individual objects they stay on the screen so basically groups are just an easy way to group things together so if you want something to happen to a bunch of objects you put them in a group and instead of calling it to active on the one object you call on the group so yeah